Hello, hello! Welcome back to Red Ted Art. Today we're going to be painting plant pots. So quick, so easy. Let's take a look. So I'm going to be using acrylic paints and some Posca pens to decorate my paint pot, uh, plant pot. But um, if you don't have acrylic paints, you can have a go at mixing normal paint with um, a little bit of glue that helps secure it. They won't be super long-term waterproof, to be honest. Um, if you want them to be waterproof, you might need a gloss enamel. But the way we're gonna be using these pots, um, just having the acrylic will be just fine because I'm actually gonna put another pot inside um, and this is gonna be the outside pot, so to speak. And yeah, all you have to do to begin with is paint your pot in the color you want it. I'm gonna do it white because I'm gonna be making panda bears but you can um, turn it into unicorns, you can turn it into uh, foxes, whatever you wish. So let's just paint this and then let it dry. So I have another pot here that I painted earlier. It's all dry. I now want to make a panda face on mine. I'm gonna use black acrylics, but to be honest, you could just use uh, Sharpies. Sharpies would work really well and uh, they're a little bit easier to manage, but um, I, I'm choosing acrylics just because I can and I kind of like the finish. It's a little bit better the finish if you do use the acrylics. I'm gonna use acrylics for the eyes and then my Posca pen or a Sharpie for the nose and the other details. So again, this is gonna be a two-step process because I want to add little white bits to my eyes. So I'll have to do some black and then uh, let it dry. And then we'll go from there. So last little detail is to add some cute little eyes <laughs> and then we're done. There we go, now the plant pot is finished. So as I mentioned before, I'm not gonna put earth in this one, I'm gonna put another pot inside. That means that if you need to change the plant around and stuff, you're not getting this one too dirty and hopefully it'll continue to look really, really nice. And yeah, that was a little craft to upcycle your plastic plant pots and turn them into something really cute. If you like this craft, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Above all, keep watching, keep making, and I'd love to see you here again soon. Take care, bye. And finally, here they are again. This is slightly under cover, so they won't get too wet, but obviously we'll get a little bit damp when watering the flowers, but that's fine. And I think they look absolutely adorable.